A uh, quick recap of last weekend. First of all, we had our uh, our first weekend of WIAC uh, games, non-conference. We went up to Superior, had a successful weekend, uh, successful night up there on Friday night. We were able to come away with the win. Um, Superior is always a tough hockey team to play, and um, to go up there in their building and get a win is a great accomplishment for us uh, early in the season. Uh, we followed that up with a trip to Eau Claire, the number one ranked team in the country right now in D3, and um, you know, unfortunately, uh, we didn't play our best hockey there even that night, but um, we had a pretty good showing. I, I was a little disappointed in, in, um, in how we played. Uh, it's, it was a great opportunity for us to go into a building against the number one ranked team and, and get a win and really kind of send some waves through college hockey a bit. But, um, you know, we didn't get the win. Uh, unfortunately, we fell 3-1 uh, uh, to one, uh, with uh, an empty netter and um, or not an empty net, or sorry, a, a late goal by them when, uh, um, in the last minute or so. But, um, you know, we played pretty well. We actually outshot them and, and had some good chances, but weren't able to come away with a win. Um, looking forward to this weekend, uh, we have two games against St. Olaf, our first weekend of MIAC conference play. Um, St. Olaf is, a, is always a hardworking, usually small, quick, hardworking hockey team that's going to be very challenging Go down there Friday night, 7.30 game uh, in Northfield, and then we could come back, a uh, quick turnaround back here at St. John's, 7 o'clock on Saturday. Um, it's going to be a great weekend uh, for Johnny Hockey and Mayak Hockey. Uh, looking forward to facing off against another Mayak opponent and you know, planning to come away with a couple wins. Uh, we're gonna, it's going to take hard work, but um, you know, we're confident in our team and looking forward to the weekend.